Today's date is May the 28th, 2020. My name's Kim Carlisle, and we live near Sheridan, Indiana, and we have a shop that's full of high Z glassware. It is open by appointment. And today's video is gonna be another segment of Half Price Thursday. This is where we pick out select items from our shop, put them out on the table outside the shop, and everything is gonna be half of what the mark price is. You might get a pencil and paper in case you see something you want, you can write it down. Also, I'm gonna show you our email address to where you can send us an email. If you have our phone number, you can always call us. Again, my name is Kim Carlisle. Email is the letter K, C-A-R-L-I-S-L, at att.net. Please note on the end of our email address where it says K Carlisle, there is no E on the end of Carlisle. So we'll go ahead and get to the items. I'll show you a quick preview of what we've got available. And then we'll go over each item. I'll describe its condition and the price. If you see anything you're interested in, we can combine pieces from one week to the next so you get a full box of things before we ship them. So you don't have to, we just don't have to ship out one piece for you. So we're going to start in this far corner. We have an eight inch round colonial basket with a very elaborate cutting on it. It's cut around the bottom. It's notched around the neck. It's got these deep flowers cut in it, notched around the scallops. The handle is scalloped. And like I say, this is called an eight inch basket, even though it's about 15 inches tall, it's called an eight inch basket because high Z baskets are measured from the outside of the handle. So this one's eight inch. Price on this one is $175. Of course, it's gonna be just half price. Next item is a thumbprint and panel vase. What's unusual about this, it is a flared vase. It's marked in the center of the bottom. It does have a scratch on the inside where someone's put their hand in and they've turned it to dry it with a ring on and scratched it. Price on this piece is $135. Here we have a piece of Fandango, which is Heisey's first pattern they ever made. And what makes this item unusual is it's square in shape. Usually these nappies are round. Nice condition, does have some wear, a few minor little chips on the bottom of it, nothing bad at all. And it's priced $50. Next item on the list, we have the Toujours Creamer and Sugar with minuet etching. Each piece is marked in the center of the bottom and the pair is $35, of course, $17.50 after the discount. I have another piece of Toujours with minuet etch. It's a foot of jelly marked inside the constriction right above the ring. This piece, piece is priced $25. Have an Empress dolphin footed mayonnaise in flamingo marked on the back of one of the dolphin feet. It's priced $17.50 and we put a ladle with it, sell separate. It's priced $35, it's signed in the middle. So if you want both pieces, it's basically gonna to come to $26 after your discount. Have another Empress dolphin footed mayonnaise. Again, it's signed on the back side of one of the feet and it's priced $25. Have a little piece of Flamingo. It's got a little hollow handle so you can use it as a serving dish. I'm not sure what the function of this item is. It is signed at the center of the bottom. It's priced $45. Have a Yeoman two-handled mayonnaise in Hawthorne, priced $15, and it is signed right on the bottom edge, on the outside edge. Narrow Flute Cordial, priced $16, signed in the middle of the bottom. Creamer and sugar and pineapple and fan, emerald green with excellent gold on it. Priced $85 for the pair. And there's no damage. Have a frog handled cheese plate. It's in flamingo. There is no damage on it, 
but it is a little bit scuffed up on the inside edge where someone set a bowl on it at one time. Priced $65. Here's a fruited bowling pin decanter. Good condition, price $75. Have six Wabash goblets with pipe piper etching. Each stem is marked in this little constriction at the top of the stem with the diamond H. And these are priced $8 a piece or $4 after discount. Pinwheel and fan custard cup or punch cup, whatever you want to call it. It's in Moongleam. It's priced $30. Empress Flamingo Berry Bowl, priced $10. Marked in the center. A pair of Mercury single light candle holders in Sahara. If you're collecting all these Mercury candle holders, the Sahara is the harder, hardest pair to find. Price $65 for the pair. And of course, with candle holders, you always want to compare the bases to make sure they're the same size. There's a little piece of fern and zircon, and it's priced $110. I think it's a handled jelly. Pair of candle holders, flamingo, price $45. Again, check the bases, same size. Have a Cecilia, about 11 inch vase. It's got Saturn optic on the inside. It's got beautiful silver overlay on it. I did notice there is a fine little scratch going right down through here. Beautiful piece and it's priced $125. Of course, it's gonna be $62.50 after the discount. Here's a fake it Fair Acre saucer champagne, moon gleam stem and foot, crystal bowl, diamond optic, marked inside the constriction, and it's $15. Here's an Empress Crut with a little wheel cutting on it. It's priced $35. It's clean inside, no damage. It's got the original stopper. Stop, stopper sits up a little high, but it is ground and fits well. Here's a beaded swag toothpick holder. It's got ruby flash in the center, ruby flash around the top, and the beads are ruby flashed. And it is not a souvenir piece. So if you collect toothpick holders, this is kind of a hard piece to find that's not souvenir. And it's priced $35. Here's a Yeoman two-handle jelly in Hawthorne with a nice little wheel cutting on it with a little cutting going around the base. And it's priced Twelve dollars and a half. Here's a solitaire ashtray and flamingo. There are several of these uh, ashtrays that were made in color. The flamingo one, in my opinion, is the hardest one to find, and it's priced fifty dollars. Two coarse rib moonglane plates, good condition. Two of them for six dollars. Signed in the center. Dolphin footed net cup, Sahara, Old Colony Etch, and it's priced $28. Fandango Salt Cellar, it's priced $5. A little bit of roughness around the top edge. Here we've got the bottom to a Moon Gleam Huidor. The top of this is supposed to have a flange on it, but at one time it's been damaged and someone has cut that flange off. Makes a nice little base. $15. Has a large diamond H in the center of the bottom. Here we have a Revere Floating Garden. It's got a large diamond H in the middle. It's priced $145. It has water lilies, cattails, bullfrogs, and dragonflies.
Nice piece. Here's a banded flute chamber stick. You can put this on your night set. It is marked in the construction and it's priced $40. Crystallite swan handled individual nut cup, $4. Here's a horse head ashtray. The main and everything's in good condition. It does have a little bitty bruise on the side and it's priced $25. Here's a narrow flute with rim oval vegetable dish, good condition, and it's priced $35. Nice deep dish to serve something out of. Here's a colonial footed jelly. It's got a large, very large diamond H in the center of the bottom. Real good condition, $5. Wing scroll custard glass vase with the wing scroll gold decoration. And this piece, when it come out of the mold, it was a small piece. And then they've took it, taken it and they've swung it out. And they've almost extended that wing scroll out to where it's hardly discernible in the pattern. I think it's about 11 inches. It's priced $125. Fair gold. I have another piece of custard glass. It's wing scroll butter dish. Excellent gold on this. And this butter dish has good color to it. Sometimes this custard glass is all washed out where it almost looks like milk glass. It's priced $125. Here's a steel rose bowl, diamond optic, and flamingo. Priced $110. A little bit of wear around the outside of it. If you've got a fancy loop punch bowl, you may want these fancy loop footed punch cups to go with it. We have six of these available, even though there's only one sitting here on the table. And they're priced 25 each. So it'd be, just be 12 and a half after a discount. We have a urn little nappy, about six inches across, signed with the diamond H in the middle. Price $15. Have a little berry bowl set here. I think it's called Octagon, but I'm not sure. You got the master berry. It's got a cutting around all the different panels. It's got a cutting on the bottom. The rays are cut, signed with the diamond H. The bowl is marked $15. We have five of these little nappies that go with it, and they're three dollars a piece. So you got a six-piece set. Last piece is we have a high Z card case. Comes in two parts. Both parts are identical, so it goes either the top or the bottom. One of these, these have little knobs on it so it fits inside so it doesn't fall off. And one of the knobs on one of them is missing. It's been broken off. So you've got half of a good card case. But looks good to display. And it's priced $25. $12 and a half after the discount. So that includes our Half Price Thursday for this week. Normally these videos start at eight o'clock in the morning. I think next week we're gonna start our Half Price Thursday video. It will start at 11 o'clock. We're gonna try that and see how that works. We have several people on the West Coast that like to buy, but they are three hours behind us. So if you see anything you're interested in, just give us a call. Hope to see you next week or for the next video. Thank you very much, goodbye.